All right, I got a battle here versus Aragon Bird from Smog on and Archives and shit. He leads with the Uxi, I lead with the Zelf, so I'm gonna U-turn, predicting a Thunder Wave. And he he has a Choice Scarf, so he gets my 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 what the fuck is it called a Zelf. He gets that shit paralyzed, and I don't want anything else getting paralyzed, so I go to Bronzong and hopefully force a switch. Now, normally, I would use Stealth Rock this turn, get him up as early as possible, but he wanted no weather and no field damage, so I can't get Stealth Rock. He goes to Machamp, I go to Slowbro to resist anything he wants to do. So, I guess he predicted a dragon coming in and he used Ice Punch. And then I just use Surf and he brings in, he brings in a Faggot Rachi, and I really hate those things that to make shit even worse, he uses Trick. So, I thought it was going to be one of those Calm Mind Jirachi, so I was going to try to Calm Mind right along with it, but that didn't work. So I go back to Bronzong because I knew it was going to have Iron Head since I saw the Choice Band. And yeah, it does have Iron Head. And then he hits me with Fire Punch, which I wasn't really expecting. So I just used Earthquake just because I can't really predict too much since it's still early game. And yeah, he hits me with another Fire Punch and crits me, so that was really fucking gay. And yeah. I go to Salamence now, trying to scare it off with Earthquake, but I don't really have Earthquake, this is my mixed Salamence, so I use Fire Blast instead, and he brings in a Porygon 2, which which pretty much counters the shit out of any physical Salamence, but mine isn't physical, it's mixed, so down goes the Porygon 2, after all of this stallness, I finally get something done. And he brings in Metagross, and I'm at like minus two special attack, so I can't hit it with Fire Blast. And I go back to Slowbro to take the Ice Punch. It, Slowbro really does a good job this battle, even though it was it was limited a lot due to the choice item. It still did really well. And he goes to a Gyarados, and I'm starting to get pissed off at his team because. I have no field damage and he's taking like six bulky Pokemon. Well, I haven't seen all six, but so far they're all bulky as hell. So I go to Salamence again and he paralyzed me. So he's spamming T Wave and that wasn't good. And I couldn't really let him dance up on me, so I used Draco Meteor. And I'll just have to go back to Slowbro. And he takes the Meteor Mash nicely. So I think I surf right here. Yeah, I use Surf, and he brings in Yuxi, and I knew he was gonna try to fool me into try to fool me into bringing out my special wall, but I saw right through that, and I I knew he was gonna have tricks, so that didn't work for him. And now he has to switch to Gay Gyarados again, and I think that's what he does. So yeah, there goes Gyarados, and I go for another Surf. And I'm trying not to let this thing Dragon Dance up because it has the potential to sweep my team now that Slowbro has a choice item. So, yeah. Then I go to Blissey because I don't know why I didn't really want, I didn't really have anything else to go to. And I use Counter predicting he would waterfall me, but he switches. So my element of surprise is gone. He knows I have Counter now. I go back to Slowbro again, and that's not doing much. So, yeah. Right here, I forgot what the fuck I do. I use Ice Beam, because I predicted the Gyarados, I guess. And I'm going to have to switch again. And that Gyarados would have been dead by now if I had Stealth Rock up. So, yeah. I go for the Freeze Hacks. Yeah, that's what I do. I go for the freeze hacks right there because that Gyarados is really kind of gay. And yeah, I'm thinking of what to do, and I just let it die because it it's do it it already did a really good job of walling his Pokemon on the physical side. And yeah, I go back to Blissey and I predict that switch. That was like really big because now his strategy of like thunder waving my entire team. And then trying to sweep me with his bulky shit is not going to work. My shit is back on fast. So right here I have to predict. He might predict me going to Salamence. Or he could just use close combat and finish off Bliss. So 
I decide he's he he's gonna take a chance and use ice punch, so I'm gonna take a chance as well and use counter, and it works out perfectly. So that was that was a good prediction, I guess. And he brings in Yuxi again, and right here I have to think a while also because he might try to T wave, or he might try to trick. And if he if he uses T wave, then one of my sweepers are gonna be pretty much useless because they're pretty frail and he has bulky ass shit and I have no rock support so that's gonna suck so I decided to just try to finish it off even if Blissey gets a choice item the way the way I'm seeing his team I could try to get some some sweeps going with with my Salamence and my Hazel so he does use Thunder Wave and I do finish him off with the Seismic Toss and he brings in back Metagross he misses a mesh, but I'm paralyzed, so that was a useless turn. And I'm just going to go for counter again and see what happens. So, Meteor Mesh did a lot of damage, so I'm guessing that thing is probably choice banned. I don't know, though. I, I didn't ask him. So, yeah, he brings in Gyarados again, and I'm just going to go for Seismic Toss, try to get as much damage in as possible. And... At this point, I know he doesn't have Dragon Dance, so I know he won't do that. I, he had plenty of opportunities to Dragon Dance on me, and he didn't do it, so he doesn't even have it. And he does finish me off with Waterfall, which is what I wanted. So, now I get to bring in Salamence and Draco Meteor, and that that's going to take a, sh a shitload of HP from him. And I know it won't kill because that's a very bulky Gyarados, judging by what Ice Beam was taking. And he uses Thunder Wave, but I'll still be able to, to KO him the next turn. And he goes to Rachi, doesn't matter though, because I went, uh, I was paralyzed and shit. So now, he's gonna use Iron Head, and I'm gonna bring in my last Pokemon that he hasn't seen, which is Infernape. And Infernape takes the Iron Head like nothing, even though it's pretty damn frail. So, Flamethrower that Jirachi, and Grass Knot the Gyarados. And that's gonna be game. Comment, rate, all that shit, and I'm out.